Hey there, Tamir from FibonaciStraders.com here with the weekly market recap. Let's see what past week brought us and let's see if we can try to identify next week price action. Before we do, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. Let's dig in the charts. Spy bullish week from 377 area all the way to the 400 now let's see if we bulls can give us continuation to the upside towards this trend line this trend line represents the lower highs since december 21 january 22 march and april of 22 and august of 22 so by default this trend line together with the 411 area will be the next major test for bulls the 411 if we look left it's a very important area for support and resistance throughout 2022. And if we look further back, 2021, March and April also support area. So by default, from support to resistance together with this trend line. And as we identify few weeks ago, this trend line here represents the higher lows since June of 2010 July June July 2010 then here 2011 almost here 16 here December 18 the crash of 2018 and now also here if we if we look at this one here COVID lows broke below this trend line, went back up, retested it a few weeks before the major move to the upside. And also here, October 22 to the penny and bounce. Now let's see if this trend line will break to the upside. By the way, check the link that will pop just about now on the right corner. A special video I made about trend lines and why, in my opinion, trend lines together with Fibonacci levels are the true support and resistance for price action. Check it out. Let me know what you think. QQQ, finally a bullish week in a very bullish, in a very bearish market. Now, let's see. 290 if they can break up and above the 290 all the way to this trend line and again trend lines represents us the trends and as we see we are still in a bears market high lower high lower high so let's see if bears can push price at least to this trend line here together with the 310 310 if we look left throughout 2022 support and resistance area and if we look further back towards december 20 and february of 2021 resistance support 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 resistance resistance and now 310 together with this trend line here will be the next major test for bulls so keep your eyes on the levels trend lines and of course follow price IWM went all the way to this trend line here this trend line from November 2021 high all the way to August 22 high and now this will be a very tough resistance for bulls so let's see if bulls have enough power in their hands to break up and above towards the 201 200 area was here resistance and also here support and resistance throughout january and from january to april of 2022 so next test for bulls first is this trend line then the 201 dow jones continuing to lead the market to the upside from this lower trend line as we identify this trend line back in october we said it was the low here the low in june 22 and a bounce from this trend line 
September bounce all the way to this trend line here last week, failed to break, made a doji to the penny on the trend line and now past week bulls came with a strong sentiment and just broke up and above next area will be the 350 but at this point some pullback retesting this trend line as a support and maybe the 325 area as a support before the next leg up 325 if we look left very important support and resistance throughout 2022 VIX is next VIX all the way to the 22 level now VIX if we look left throughout time VIX does not have any gaps so this small gap here will get filled probably next week VIX breaking to the downside this is why now we finally can have a relief bounce and maybe even a small small bull rally throughout December and what's left of November dollar index as we said last week until it will not break below this box we will not get a relief rally and came last week breaking down with power to the downside 107 tried to hold on Thursday but then came Friday and next support for the dollar index is the 104 so also keep your eyes on the dollar index with the VIX and the US 10 year the US 10 year yields is an also a very important indicator for the indices because once this one breaks down and under the indices can get their relief bounce and as we identified a few weeks ago that this might end the crazy rally we had now let's see if this trend line will be next for price action this trend line goes all the way back to november 2021 december 21 to the penny of february 22 to the penny of july 22 and now i expect it to be a major support for price action price action breaking down and under and this area of the 310 320 will be the next support so always keep your eyes on the us 10 year dollar index vix they are the most important indicators for the market once these three goes down the market will go up these three go up market will go down so i hope everyone having a great weekend and until the next video take care have fun and i'll see you in the next video